Hello everybody, it's Kim Q, Business and Fun All in One, coming to you out of Atlanta, Georgia, and I was about to say AtlantaGeorgia.com, <laughs> coming to you out of Atlanta, Georgia, and I wanted to talk to you really quickly about the absolute worst phrase that you can use, and if you hear it coming from a prospect or a business partner's mouth, you should immediately stop them, and it's a common phrase that people use to basically justify where they are right now and their lack of of urgency and taking action and the phrase is it's not that bad it's not that bad guys I used to be guilty of using this phrase quite frequently and you really now that I've become more cognizant and just so much more conscientious of my words and the power of my words that phrase makes me cringe because again like I said what you're doing when you say it's not that bad is you're giving yourself an excuse to not live the life that you're supposed to live to not do what you know you're supposed to do to not take action right now so that it doesn't get that bad in the future and oh my gosh you've got to shock somebody into reality if they if you hear them using that phrase make them think about what would be that bad when do you think it will become that bad if you keep going at the rate that you're going right now how soon do you think it will get that bad because usually guys their answer is is off <laughs> okay they'll say I, I don't or usually they've never even thought about it do you know that they've never even thought about when it will get that bad so you've got to be the person to hold that mirror up to them and say look at yourself in the face and let's face reality because if you're saying it's not that bad it actually is but you're trying to justify it you're trying to hide from it and you cannot do that guys because if you do it will get that bad quicker than you think every single time and anyone who has used that phrase like myself knows that this is true so I, I encourage you strongly don't you ever use that phrase and if you ever hear someone using it don't just leave them be and say well okay if you really truly care for people and you have a heart for them, ask them questions to make them realize that it's actually worse than you think if that phrase is the only justification you can give for your current situation. So guys, I hope you found this video helpful. I hope you will use the tip that I said just to jerk them into reality. Please like, comment, and share if you did. Also, follow me over at dailyqtips.com. The videos that I cut over there are a little bit different than the videos that I have over here, and I'm sure you don't want to miss a thing. So I'll see you over there. Take care. Bye-bye.